Welcome to the Bobcat News. Hi, I'm Trace. And I'm Andrew. If you're interested in student leadership or a member of a club or team at MHS, the Student Senate might be for you. Student Senate, a brand new way to look at student leadership next year. We've reorganized student council. So we have a president, we have two vice presidents, we have a student athletic director, and we have other positions within each of the classes. The Student Senate uh, will have delegates from the football team and the yearbook group and just a whole bunch of everyone involved. This will allow everyone to be able to have their voices heard and collaborate on timings and events an opportunity to let the administration know what's going on as well as allow the administration to talk to these students individually. On top of that we'll have a club council which will be made up of delegates from each of the clubs. The difference with that and the student senate is the club council is made up by organizations the students uh, organize whereas the student senate is made up by um, organizations that the school organizes and runs. Student Senate and Club Committee will begin at the beginning of next school year. A shout out for anyone who is interested in becoming a student leader. There are positions in every grade. There's also student council positions. Uh, come visit with me in my classroom. I have applications. I have answers. If you've ever thought about being a leader or making a difference as a leader in this school community, now is the time to come and get some information. We'd love to have you be part of the team. Students coming on the Social Studies East Coast Tour, it is almost time to go. The final meeting is this Thursday at 5.15 p.m. in Mr. Stewart's room. This meeting is for all students coming on the trip and their parents. Please plan on attending. Choir editions are finishing up this week. Check out this video for more information. Hello. For those of you who might not know me, I'm Mr. Hink, and I'm the choir director here at Madison High School. I'm standing on the stage of our beautiful Madison Performing Arts Center. Right now it's quiet, but anyone who's been in this part of the building very much knows that soon the lights will turn on, the audience will be in place, the performers will be ready, and another performance will begin. Perhaps you are already a part of one of the groups that perform here, but if you are not, I would like to extend an invitation to you to consider auditioning to be a part of one of the choirs here at MHS. Auditions are happening this week on Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. You can sign up for an audition time on the choir room door where you will also find a QR code that will take you to additional information about what you need to do for your audition. Being a part of choir is so much more than just singing. It is about developing your talents, creating friendships, learning to understand your importance as a member of a team, performing with professionals in the entertainment industry, travel, and many other things. So come be a part of the great choir tradition here at Madison High School. If you have any questions, please visit with me. I'm looking forward to seeing you at auditions. We're keeping it funky fresh here on the Bobcat News and keeping it here for sports. Trace? Oh, thanks, Drew. Good luck to the track team today at Skyline. Baseball is home today against Highland. And tennis is home today against Century. Golf is at Bonneville tomorrow. And the softball team is home against Highland on Thursday. Mm -hmm. The Madison Rodeo team is competing on Friday and Saturday at the fairgrounds. If you like to play pickleball or want to learn, then meet at the Fieldhouse during second lunch. Have a great day and please stand for the pledge. <laughs> 